Hey guys, welcome to a brand new episode. Today I present you a project that has huge potential. We've seen a massive surge in tokens at the moment. Gaming tokens are going up as well. So are we going into the next bull run? We saw a lot of 100x potentials in the early days and the best way to get involved in that was finding solid projects with strong professional teams, existing development, existing markets and strong communities. And this is a project that has all of that and more. We have Space Catch. So this is the trailer for it, which in my opinion looks really, really cool, really professional. They have a professional gaming studio behind this. They have quick game development. The demo live version is already available to play. They have a strong community and a live pre-sale that at the moment is showing tremendous success. And they're positioning themselves to be one of the strongest AR and Web3 game five projects on the market. So as we can see from the trailer, Space Catch is a next generation augmented reality Web3 game that has come with a very clever sustainable earning concept that doesn't rely on the inflow of new users, something that's been a problem in the past for games. Space Catch is designed and developed by a professional gaming studio following gaming industry standards focused on sustainability and they're looking to offer top quality gameplay that will have a high retention rate of its users. It's great to see new professionals entering into GameFi with a new generation of games and this one has a huge opportunity alongside it in terms of you can invest in their pre-sale going on at the moment. So here we have it, Space Catch. This is the demo version of the game. Here we can see some of the AR footage. If you don't know what AR stands for, it's augmented reality. If you've ever played Pokemon Go, you'll be very familiar with this. It uses the phone's capabilities to deploy virtual elements from the game into your surroundings. And I think that Space Catch has the ability to lead AR gaming because of the fact that it's not just an AR game, it incorporates a lot of Web3 features like NFTs with multiple utility and move to earn concepts. And this is what could have worked really well with Pokemon Go, you know, having a marketplace, having leaderboards and actually being rewarded in NFTs or currency that you can get in games. So that's why I think it'll stand out. Having those added features will set it apart from games that don't have Web3 technology integrated into them. So here we have the game. Pixel Field is a professional gaming studio that is behind creating this. It's a British game development studio that has been in the market for seven years. And one of its primary focuses has been on augmented reality games. They've already developed an AR game, which has more than 100,000 downloads and are more than capable of making Space Catch a fascinating AR gaming experience that people will want to play. It's that you understand Space Catch is not coming in for the hopes and promises. So I think it's really important going into investing in a project like this that you know that they're coming from a place of wanting to create something that they already have a clear vision for. They have the professionalism behind it to enter the Web3 gaming space and develop something that they're aiming to be, you know, one of the top five gamify projects in the next couple of months. And it's not one of those games that, you know, in the past we've seen that has suggested a game that they're going to create. And in a years, you're going to see some actual ability to play it. This is a project that is going to bring, you know, the game out alongside the token. So you're going to be able to start playing it. They've obviously got a detailed white paper that details some of the uh, things that you'll have in games. So projectile weapons, chargeable weapons, we've got potions and throwable weapons that obviously you'll be used in catching the aliens. They have a list of some of the aliens and some of the designs already up there. They have hubs and shelters, which I think will be a cool feature to add into the game. These will be connected to points of interest and places on the map. And as you see, as you visit them, you'll automatically be healed. So there'll be a place to go and heal. They'll also offer you a place to be able to to the jail area where you'll be able to leave an alien as well so this is not just a concept it is something that they really thought about and designed and got all the kind of framework that they need it's just getting it out ready for people to be able to play so as you can see it's not something that is just a concept they already have working artwork designs the game functions well in the demo it's going to have all these features like building your hero up, training and upgrading, standing your ground and facing spawned aliens, and selling and renting of your assets as well. Something that you obviously not going to be able to do in non web three games. Those NFTs and boosters are going to be things that you can buy, sell and rent to other players. So getting in early and, you know, working on leveling up your characters and NFTs could be really, really fruitful. And features like being able to buy, sell, rent or lease 
NFTs and equipment items. This is going to be something that could bring in some steady income, you know, down the line. When there's a demand for some of these items increasing, you might be able to sell them and just rent them out to make that passive income. So I think that's one of the unique features that you'll get with Web3. The game has so many earning mechanics of planning to kick back rewards for players to taking part in things like move to earn. So get rewarded for actual your physical activities in the form of trophies that you'll be able to sell non NFT and NFT boosters to other players. They'll have mini games so in Q2 of 2024. You'll be able to take part in playing and earning, focusing on training players, avatars and defeating aliens outside. There'll be character building. So you'll be able to level up your characters and avatars and you'll then be able to sell them to the players who want to get an advanced start in the game don't want to begin at level one and then there will also be nft lending so you'll be able to lend your nft items to other players to use and as a reward you'll get currency back in the form of their token now i definitely encourage you to check out the white paper it's very in-depth and they also have the roadmap on there so obviously if you're investing into this project by taking part in the catch pre-sale then you're going to want to know exactly what the stages are of release in terms of public beta launch going live in q1 we've got in q2 a listing tier one and in q3 we've got things like multiplayer being made available ai custom quests and one thing i will mention is is obviously when you're looking to invest in the catch token which we'll talk about and i'll show you exactly how to access this this is not going to be the reward token in game so obviously they've learned from past games where if you have that people then sell that main token and it can be a real problem um what they want to build is a sustainable economy within the game so they will be using an other form of token as a reward not the catch token so remember you're investing in something that's not going to be paid out to people for playing the game one thing that i think is important to mention is that the catch token that we see here the pre-sale that's going on which we're going to go to take a look at later is not going to be the reward token players will be rewarded in inflationary and non-inflationary nfts in the game uh so obviously they want to build a sustainable economy and this is one of the ways they're doing that and I think this model will really protect its investors. So you're investing in something that isn't you know, just going to directly be paid out to other people as a reward. Um, you're investing in the project and it will have utility outside of the game. Now the catch token is going to be listed alongside version one of space catch so it'll have immediate utility before we talk about the token though let's talk about the nfts they've already had one nft sale and the first 500 of the 10,000 nfts to be released were sold out within 33 seconds showing the strong demand for them the next nft sale is planned for q1 of 2024 so look out for that I definitely recommend following their social media all the links of which will be down in the description below for you to be able to follow and keep up to date with when that goes live okay so let's talk about the catch token now this big investment opportunity you can visit the website down below uh, i put my referral link in there so you'll be able to join using that that gives rewards up to five percent to people who um, have referred, referred people and they've then invested there are also volume bonuses as well so up to 12 percent. so if you um, invest 5,000 to 100,000, you'll get a 12% bonus in terms of tokens. With 500 to 1,500, you'll get 3%. Uh, to make your own referral link, you can go down here and click right. And as you can see, you'll get a unique code that you can copy and post and share with your friends across social media. So you can make investments in ETH, USD, or Visa payments as well. And you will receive catch when the token is listed. Simple right so what do you need to know about the catch token well it's an erc20 token ensuring security and sustainability for transactions the whole tokenomics is designed to support the game's development and its added features giving a chance of gaining 100x in the first year being that it's not the reward token now the initial market cap excluding liquidity is going to be 342,000. If the market cap reaches 35 million during the first few months, the price of the token will be $6. So some big X's to make if it gets there. And if we take a look at GameFi tokens like Alluvium, in just a month, we've seen a huge bump in token price, so 150% extra in the token value. 
uh, which obviously was a massive increase in its market cap. So there is clearly a lot of money to be invested in GameFi and other people are seeing potential and projects that are gonna be you know, big in the space. So what about the utility of the catch token when the game goes live? So it's gonna be designed for the gameplay features. You'll be able to use it for immediate recovery of health tools, in-game lotteries, premium missions, premium NFT boxes, auctions of premium NFT items or premium events uh, for other players for NFT boosters and for other players to for any form of items or assets. Now, obviously, you don't have to play the game. You can hold the token and obviously people are going to be using the game up for these features um, like you would in any in-app purchase of any game that's not in the Web3 space and that value though is going to be paid back to you as an early investment you're really invested in the game so mathematically as the game becomes more successful and attracts a larger user base more catch tokens will be involved in the game which means an increase in its price and space catch will also have a really attractive staking mechanism which is the only other way of being able to obtain catch other than purchasing it directly um, so the staking mechanism will have a halving method as well so all investors can stake their tokens mostly during the first year to gain a lot of extra tokens so guys we are so early on this project this is about seeing potential in something that could go a long way in the future this is not any crypto crazy kid that's raising money this is a skilled team of people entering into game fi aiming to be winners in the next bull run so hopefully you can come along that ride it's got multiple youtubers already launching promotions for space catch so it's obvious that the team are pushing this hard and getting everything done professionally so here we see some behind the scenes footage of them filming the Space Catch trailer. Uh, you might recognize Oliver Kim. He featured in some Netflix movies. Here we can see some behind the scenes footage, some photos that they took of them doing this recording. And I think this definitely demonstrates that these guys are hard at work trying to produce something of high quality, ready for you know the same level of quality that they're gonna be putting out with the game as well. And if you don't trust me on this being a good investment, check out Ico Holder. They rated this at a 4.56 positive so that's out of five highly positive for the ico profile vision team product potential and activity so they're pegging it to be a good investment as you can see we're in the pre-sale now you've still got that opportunity they've got loads of information on the company as well so we've got about and talks about the features roadmap similar things that you can see in the white paper we've also got the verified team members 100 percent verified so this is looking like a really strong project to invest in and with 100k being raised in just the first few hours of this going live Clearly, there are people who see potential in this. It's just whether you do as well. And I think check out the trailer, do your research into the project, see whether it you know covers all bases for you. So get yourself over to spacecatch.io now. Use the link down in the description below. There you'll be able to pick up some catch and add it to your portfolio. The bull run is coming and getting those tokens early on, early as possible we'll see the biggest potential in profit. So obviously getting in now before the token goes up in price, 33% is a big thing. So all in all, I think we saw between 2021 and 22, a lack of execution on project ideas. Uh, some that fell short of standards, I think. Space Catch has a pretty different approach to things. Uh, it's obvious that they're professionals who are gonna try and conquer the gaming market by developing a game that is high quality. Uh, I had an opportunity to even try the demo and it does work really, really well. AR works great on it. So it's clear the team is only a few days from being able to get the product ready for launch. The team is robust. It's one where the project is great and there's a lack of competitors in the AR realm of Web3 gaming market. So the project doesn't have as much competition that could make the, 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 the Pokemon Go. Pokemon Go came out and then loads of imitators came out, Jurassic World Alive. Um, we saw Walking Dead come out and they didn't compete because they weren't the first out of the gates and Space Catch could well, looks poised to be that so in terms of potential starting with the super low market cap that it currently has the team pays most of the costs with usdt to protect the price of catch in the future uh with a focus on long-term success this is definitely a project that could do really well in a bull market and most importantly it's not a stupid clicker game uh like we've seen in the past it's something that's robust has ar technology has a little bit of something different and more to it 
that will make it an enjoyable gaming experience. To get yourself over to the website, pick yourself up as much catch as you want and add it to your portfolio, getting yourself ready to see if this booms in the bull run. Check it out. All the links will be down in the description below. That is all for this one. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. If you have, please a like on the video if you have. Okay, well, that's all for today's video. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, please go down into the links below. Check out the description and you can use that to get... Okay, well, that's all for this one. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. If you do like the video, go down into the description below. There's the referral link. You can use that and you can get up to 5% bonus if you create that link to refer to other people. So get going, get sharing, get investing, and hopefully we see some big, big things happen in the next bull run. So, okay, well, we'll leave it there for today's episode. If you have liked this project, definitely go check it out using the link in the description below. Maybe pick yourself up some catch and get ready for the next bull run where you know projects like this could do really really well uh definitely recommend going to their socials as well and making sure that you follow them you know i've gone and followed and click that notification bell to stay up to date with any changes that they'll make they've got instagram all of those which can be found at the bottom of their website page if you have enjoyed this please hit subscribe as well. Always helpful to have new people watching videos and we'll have some big things coming in the future. That's all for this one. See you guys soon.